Mary Washington Bachelier, February 22, 1860, November 5, 1939 was an American physician and Baptist medical missionary in India. Mary Washington Bachelier was born February 22, 1860, in New Hampton, New Hampshire, the daughter of relevant Otis Robinson Bachelier and his second wife, Sarah P. Merrill Bachelier. When Mary was a girl, she moved to India, where her father, a medical doctor and ordained minister, and her mother, an educator, were Baptist missionaries at Midnipur. As a teen she worked with her mother, visiting and teaching women in Zanana. She returned to the United States to pursue a medical degree at the Women's Medical College in New York City. Bachelera completed her medical degree in 1890, and was appointed to assist her father, as the first medical missionary of the Free Baptist Woman's Missionary Society. She took over her parents' work at Midnipur when they retired in 1893. She taught school and provided medical care for women who would not see a male doctor for religious reasons. She was in the United States in 1900 for her own health, and to tend to her ailing parents, they died in 1900 and 1901. I suppose I worked too hard after father and mother left, she recalled, for several times she got low fever and was quite incapacitated. She spoke in New England churches while she was on leave. Bachelier returned to India in 1903, and lived with Miss Lavina Coombs in Midnipur, until Bachelier was transferred to Balasore in 1910. The two women traveled to the United States for rest in 1912 to 1913. Bachelier was back in India in 1914, first helping a Miss Butts at Shantipur, and then back in Balasore to run an orphanage there. She spoke the Bengali and Odia languages fluently. Bachelier returned to the United States in 1921 for the Jubilee of the Woman's American Baptist Free Missionary Society, with Midnipur teacher Kanto Balarai. She retired in 1933 and left India in 1936. Bachelier died in 1939, aged 79 years, in Newton, Massachusetts. There is a small collection of her papers at the American Baptist Historical Society archives.